what's up y'all welcome back welcome to another uh weekend single mom vlog um it is saturday i'm lying it is friday and it is 10 20 and yeah i just want to come in and get y'all uh opening to the vlog that is supposed to start today and uh yeah i didn't record anything today um yeah, I didn't do anything go anywhere. I washed clothes today. I went to my parents' house, stayed over there. My sister cooked spaghetti, and me and my kids ate over there. And now I'm home. And I just came from Walmart, like just walked through the door. And uh, I had went and got some stuff because, yeah, I just wanted some hot chocolate because my kids kept getting all the hot chocolate. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go to Walmart and get me some almond milk so I can make me some hot chocolate, even though they had to use water. So, anyways, so while I was in there getting, they don't have the, the almond milk that I actually like down here in my Walmart. I got, I went in there for almond milk and marshmallows. So, got that. Also got these. And I got these, which I'm about to go try on. Um, yeah, I didn't want these. I wanted to, there were some black ones with um, colors on it, green and all that. Those are the ones I wanted. But all they had was extra large, extra, extra large. And that was it. They didn't have no medium. Small as nothing. I'm hoping they get some more in stock of that color. But I'm going to try these on. I hope they look cute on me. Ooh. Okay, so anyways. Um, yeah. Um, so, this is what the weekend is looking like. We going to Baby Girl's uh, Dress Scout meeting again. So, her meetings are on the first and third Saturdays. Which I kind of want them to move it to second and fourth. And I'm going to ask them that tomorrow because... I typically would go to minister's class on first and third, but I actually haven't been to minister's class since, I think, July. I went to one. When it got warm, I went to one. And now that it's cold, I'm probably not going to go to another one, but I don't know. My son, I forgot to tell y'all, my son made the basketball team. Woo! Yay! Uh, son, you going to say something? Okay, he made the basketball team. Good for him. All right. So... Y'all can see I still need to put clothes up and clean up, but it'll get done. But anyways, I know one of one thing that I am about to do this evening um, while he is watching TV in the living room. My daughter's in her room watching TV. And I am actually on Discord. We are having, a, I'm on Discord having a After the Dark. We just finished movie night and we're having a af, Discord After Dark. That's what we're having. Uh, yeah, y'all don't want to know what that is. I'm not watching at the moment. So, but anyways, um, just different types of movies. But anyways, okay, um, so I don't know if I'm going to finish watching that or not. I am about to polish my nails with a different color because this done got all chipped. Look, look at this. It done came all off and everything. But anyways, all right. Um, yes, I am about to let my daughter open her shoes. Finally, it's, they've been here two, three weeks now, and she still ain't seen them or know anything about them. So I'm going to let y'all see that real quick. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I tell you, kids, just they just want to talk when I'm trying to record and stuff. Yeah. <sighs> okay, so, oh, what I was saying was, Girl Scout meeting tomorrow. We were going to go to the fair and skip the Girl Scout meeting. However, it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow in my town. And... Where the fair is in Augusta, Columbia County Fair, uh, it's supposed to start raining at 7. And then, I guess it's going to trickle off. And then, 10 and 11, it's going to pick back up. And that was the time I was going to take them to the fair. So, I called my nephew and was like, you know what? Hey, we're just going to go to the fair Sunday at the church. Because, for one, the temperature will be 65 degrees. And I'm like, hey, yes, I need it to be warm because tomorrow, the highest it's going to be is 55. And uh, I'm not trying to get sick at all. None the rest of the year. My goal is not to get sick every year. You know, I kind of shoot for that every year. It, you know, just whatever. You know, things happen. So, but yeah. So we're going. Can you stop playing with my marshmallows, please? Thank you. Um. So yeah, girls got meeting tomorrow. Fair Sunday at the church, and we may try the new Taco Bell um tacos. Um. Yeah, we may try those tomorrow or Sunday after Sunday before going to the fair. You know what? I think that's what we'll do. We'll try those before um, we go to the fair. So that way they'll be done got some food in their system before we get there. So that way they can like, at least for an hour, walk around 
walk around <laughs> and then you know ride, ride all the rides they want because I bought tickets uh, on Monday for all of us so yeah our monthly out outing for the month will be the fair so and then December our monthly outing will be um, Augusta on ice I want to do that since they first brought it because I've never been ice skating and I really want to go so I'm hoping that we can do that for our, our monthly outing for December now either the Augusta on ice or urban air which is a rock climbing jungle plate jungle place rock climbing bungee jumping not bungee jump, I don't know what they just be doing a bunch of stuff and I know the rock climbing, climbing is in there so I want to do that um skating or movie well I don't even go into movies um, yeah, so yeah, those are the three options. Two options? Three. Yeah. That's three. Skating, Augusta on Ice, or Urban Air for December. That'll be our monthly item for that. So this video is actually, this video, Jesus Christ, the intro. It's been kind of long. But, um, yeah, I'm going to show y'all my daughter's shoes and let her see them. So, yeah. Okay, so... This is my first Vitacost um, order, but it got messed up, so I had to um, request a replacement. Okay, I only have 10% battery left, so let's do this very quickly. Um, either I'm going to talk very slowly like normal and speed up the time. All right, so my order from Vitacost came this week, and I ordered two bags. Well, you had to order two bags because it only came two, so you couldn't just order one. It was a minimum of two. So I ordered a whole wheat pastry flour, flour, <laughs> flour because I saw this on Steph and Tasha and I was like, what, they have whole wheat pastry flour? I was like, I got to try it, have to try it, got to try it. Um, yeah, so uh, one was not open, it was good. I've already put it in my pantry in a container, but the box was full of, you know, I don't know if y'all can see that, but yeah, y'all can kind of see the flour in the bottom down there. Um, ooh. Yeah, all that. So I was like, why is this, like, um, all this flour in the bottom of it? And I went to, you know, get the bags out. And this one has, Jesus, has a cut right there. And so I was like, oh, no, we're not using this. I don't know if a rat did it or, um, uh, uh, a knife, a box cutter or something. So maybe they got it out of a big pack and they slid it by accident and sent it to me. So, yeah. So then I had this and this um, smushed down and kind of open. So I requested another one of these, but I'm going to keep this one for the simple fact that the reason this is smushed, they don't package the right. They put both these big five pound bags of flour on top of this. Like, this big old box, you could just stood everything up, you know, and in the box like this, and it would have been fine. But they didn't do that. They just threw it in the box and bust the um, pasta open. This is quinoa penne, quinoa and rice penne pasta. So, yeah. So, basically, uh, what's in this Vitacost box here is just a replacement of both of these items. And I don't need to open that up. So let's move on to the next thing. Oh, oh yeah, just like I said, I'm not sure that is. Uh, I hope this one ain't open because this show. Oh, this box got flour in it too. I hope. I really hope this is not open. Oh, really? Look at this, y'all. Another bag. I'm not doing an online uh, replacement. I'm calling. Not today, but Monday. I sure am. That does not make any sense. Who they think for the use it if it's open? COVID going on? Um, rats and mice and stuff probably being in these warehouses and stuff. I don't know. But, yeah, no. No, 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 no. So, no. Um, I got this in the mail. It says manufacturer for drive. And it just says drive on it. It ain't got my address on it. It ain't got nothing on it. It just says drive. I don't know what this is. So we put a oh, we put a see together what this is.
some pain just came just in and I feel like I'm going to have to uh finish this but um okay so drive power neb ultra it's a nebulizer um yeah uh we will discuss this later on because my battery is absolutely about to die okay so because the lighting just went completely down so we're just going to finish this but it's a nebulizer um we can discuss this when i come back because yeah did not know this was coming all right so i'll be back see y'all in a couple hours after i take a nap It's not nothing else in there. Give me that. <laughs> Hello Fresh. Whatever. Um, try them on real quick. I showed you to sit down so you can be in the video. Yeah. So these are the Ugg boots that was like $54, but I got them for $22. Wow, I mean, come here. Oh, you got room, man. All right, well, there you go, some boots. Your legs have so many bruises on them. I got so many hair pipes on them. Anyways, all right, y'all. She's gonna open up her boots. They are very pretty. Yay for her. All right, see y'all tomorrow. Good morning, good morning. How's y'all doing today? It's Saturday, and we are headed to Girl Scout meeting number two. So, yeah. And today I will be letting that window up right there, getting that bag off, and letting the window up because it is not, it is no longer getting hot in the afternoon. So I can let the window up now. And yes, the window. I've always been able to go up it just would not come back down so I kept it down when I actually was able to let it down I was like oh my gosh the buttons work on the door so yeah um, I was like not letting this window up and then I was like it rained one day and I was like well let me let it up and then it I'll let it up a little bit and it wouldn't come back down so I was like oh no not letting it up just gonna put a bag over it so that's what I did for many many months and now that it's cold it's time to let the window up all the way so anyways all right see y'all when we get to the library okay so i just went in the uh the room where the meetings are and nobody's there and it's 10 10 and uh let me check my messages on facebook nope nothing and see what's going on because anybody in the room in the library um the meeting room where we have the girls got me oh i'm sitting in the library right now um yeah let me send this message on facebook and see all right i'm gonna go back out here again see if they are here 
Nobody's out here still. Nobody is in here. Nobody. All right, I'm gonna go back home. I'm actually gonna go to Walmart and take these pants back and get the extra large because apparently um, Walmart's slipping on their sizes. So I'm gonna go do that and go see if the um, pharmacy has a medicine for me because I don't know what's going on with this thing they sent me. So I'll see y'all in a bit. Just left the bakery. Somebody didn't get anything. And she back there crying. And guess who don't care? Me. Children can't follow directions. They don't get nothing. I tell my kids all the time, do things, and yet they do what they want to do. I told her to pick two cookies from the top row or two of the yellow or orange glazed cookies or icing or whatever it was on it, sprinkle or something. No. What's she going to do? Well, I wanted this and that. Oh, you know what I told the girl? She ain't getting nothing. I got what I wanted out of there and left. So she calls herself and her brother not to get anything because she can't follow freaking directions. I don't play that. I'm so sick of my kids not following directions and doing what I tell them to do. Now, it gets on my last nerve. A lot of things get on my last nerve with my kids, but hey, joys of being single parents. Okay, so I'm in Walmart and these are the ones that I was talking about yesterday that I want. It says Mary and something another, but they got a little uh, reindeer on it. And I was like, oh, these are so cute. I want these, but they ain't got none of my size. They got the extra, extra large and the extra, extra, extra large. So I got a large in the ones I had. So I need an extra large. But I'm sure the 2X and 3X large would be too big. So I really wish they had. <sighs> got these with a black cat on it, but I don't like these. I'm gonna get these. And I got some gray ones with Santa Claus on them. Oh, and these things are warm. This is my first time getting a pair of these. And I feel like, ooh, they're so warm and cozy. I don't know if I wanna wear them out of them. Wear them around the house, shoot. I got some black and white ones. These go good up under um, a nice long sleeve button down shirt or something with some boots. That'll be good with that. Let me see. They ain't got that one in my size either. Okay, I'm gonna get this extra large in this one and extra large in the one, nope. Okay, so they got this one just all red. What does it say? Oh, follow la la la. And then this is the one I actually bought yesterday that I'm at it changed. So they got this one with the blue in it and then this one just with the burgundy. I don't know, when I see these two different colors, I kind of don't know which one I want to get. My daughter is over there upset. She's staying away from me because she's mad and upset. She will be all right. Oh well. Anyways. All right, I'm gonna get these two and go home and try them on. See y'all back at the house. Right, so I'm about to let this window up. All right, about to let the window up. Let's see if it's gonna go back down. Nope. <clears throat> nope, nope, nope. Let me show you. All right, let me put the little bit left. Oh, and it's done. So, there's a lot of tape on it. And it won't, uh-oh, won't go back down. So, oh well, okay. That's done, I need to check the mail. Let me see what time it is. It is 11.22. I'll go check it at 12. But I'm out the door now. And I'm not going to look out the door. So, yeah. I'm probably just going to check it now before I go in the house. All right.
Hey. Okay, so I'm home. Just got an Amazon package. Got my lights all white. These were four for twelve ninety eight or something like that. Yeah, I think that's what it was. So yeah, that's that's my Amazon package for this week. That's the only thing I that that's on a subscribe and save. So yeah, and I get it every four to six months. So, but anyways, I just tried on my um my leggings from Walmart, and they are so comfortable and soft. And I'm about to keep them on today. Cause they is cute. So yeah. Um. Oh, I know what I want to say. My daughter in the cookie. So the cookie she wanted was like about this big, and it was like four dollars. I'll say about this big. Not this big. About this big. So and it's four four dollars for that one cookie, and I'm I. Was gonna get them. I was gonna get my son one, the blue ice one, and then get my daughter the pink ice one. And then I looked at the price, and they was like during their four dollars. So I was like, eh, no. So what I am gonna do, I am gonna get one next week when I get my three dollars and eighteen cent from my child support from one of my kids' dad. Yeah, that's all. That's all. That they pay three dollars and eighteen cent every two weeks. One of my kids' dads. But anyways, I guess. I better be grateful for that, huh? So, yeah. So, next week, I'm going to uh, use the money to get the cookie. And I'm going to show y'all the cookie because I really don't think it should be no $4 for that one cookie. Two fifty, two seventy five dollars at the most. Definitely would not do that for. And I was not. I wouldn't do that for $4. So, and what I was about to say was I was not in the realm of. Paying, paying a lot of money at the bakery today. I spent two dollars and seventy something cent um, at the bakery today, and I had a five dollar bill. And like I said, I was not gonna pay no thirty four dollars for one cookie. So she had the choice of getting the fifty cent cookies. She chose to act up in the in the place and ended up with nothing. So, anyways, that's all for now. I'm gonna go. I did my painted my nails last night orange. And these are still blackish, burgundy undertone. So I'm going to take these off and repaint them the same color. So it'll be like orange and black nails. Hey, okay. So anyways, that's what I'm about to do. And I'm about to uh, rewatch my last upload because I think I needed to block out something I forgot. So anyways, um, yeah, that's it. Girl Scout meeting didn't happen. So... Chilling at the house for the rest of the day. Good morning, y'all. We are getting ready for church. Well, I'm pretty much ready. I'm just gonna spruce up this girl's hair. Ooh, it is dry. Anyways, we'll take care of this after church, after the bath. All right, so, anyways, good morning, church, fair, some more places, home. See y'all later. Ooh, my lipstick is like so messed up. Church was awesome. Baby girl's like, it was so good today. Oh my goodness. Um, we were having, a, a, well not we, a prophet came to speak to first lady today and they're in there doing that. And sadly, I couldn't stay. I, mean, I guess I could have stayed for the whole thing, but I already had told my nephew that to meet me at Burger King so we can go to the fair because they're supposed to go to the fair and I'm just like, dang, I want to stay. <sighs> but I can't. It's a couple, it's, some other people didn't stay either, but I really want to stay. I like when prophets come to you. I like when our bishop be talking, okay? He be on it. Oh, church was so good. Okay, let me come back because church was so good today. Okay, all right. Anyways, all right, we for the... Uh, we leave in church. We could have head to a bird camp, pick up my nephew. I actually think my sister is actually coming to the fair, but I'm not sure. But I think so because she texted me while I'm in church, which I hate. Don't text the call. When, well, they know not to call when I'm in church, but they're going to text while I'm in church. So, I mean, she just asked how much for it was to get in. So, I texted back and told her. But, um, 
yeah so she just texted me a little just just now asked where i was i told him on the way and i ain't even left yet but i'm on the way so yeah we better go and uh yeah meet up see if she going um i hope my nephew has all the money because i got everybody some fun well not everybody i have my kids 20 dollars a piece um i wish my son would hurry up because i mean if he was we come out to church and then he was gonna go around the corner and, and take a leap and i'm like if you don't take your behind back in the church to go to the restroom but now he's taking so long to go to the restroom but if you all you had to do was pee you shouldn't take you that long to pee anyways whatever here you come so but all right we'll see y'all at the fair we are in this long behind line for the fair it's very long we've been in this line since 138 it is 142 We're at the fair. I didn't take the lipstick off because it is ugly on me now. So it was matching my shirt earlier though. But um, so we here about to start our weekend vlog, family vlog. Hey guys. Where's Aiden? Where's Aiden? Gonna get left. Yep. Yep. Ooh ooh. Candy, candy. Candy, candy. I got candy. So uh, my sister did decide to bring my nephew, even though it went yesterday. Uh, she just want to spend extra money, unnecessarily, like always. We here, we got our stamps for unlimited rides. I don't know where we going, I don't know what my children doing. Whew. But we're going to have some fun. I may or may not get some footage, but hey, if I do, good. If I don't, oh well. My sister decided not to buy any tickets for her to ride with my nephew, so she gonna ask me whatever ride he wants to get on, I have to ride with him. I'm not that auntie. <laughs> she don't like being on camera, so I'm gonna have to sneak and get on here a little bit. Look at these chilling.
don't get off? Decision, but I had a lot of fun. Whatever you do, I did not regret it. I did not regret it. I did not regret it. Not much, but I did regret it. Where's your bag? Here. Where's your bag? In the car. Where's your twenty dollars? Oh, okay. Cause I was like, I didn't even like. What do you do? That's well, I wouldn't pay no attention. Right. Anyway. Like, that's right. Don't eat before. Hey, all right. This after this next ride, y'all need to get y'all something to eat, and then let it sit for like thirty minutes before y'all get on another ride. So you can ride another ride, or you can get something to eat right now. And wait a minute. So what y'all want to do? My last ride with my daughter. This one right here. And that's it, because I got sick. And the kids in front of me did it. How about you move out my way? Those group of boys right there did that. And they even tried to. Can't take kids nowhere. Don't make no damn I should have recorded them doing it too. Hey y'all, what's up? This is going to be the end of the vlog from going to the fair. So I ended up going to the ER, but I left two hours after I got there. Yeah, that's a story time in itself for another day. So anyways, how did y'all enjoy the fair? See, it was, um, good. it was good. I did not get to ride all the rides I wanted to. There's always next year. Are you sure about that? But I'm like, John Smith, are you sure about that? I like, hope they bring it back. After what happened, they were like, hold on, should we bring it back over there? <clears throat> or they were like, should we bring it closer to Augusta? Because everybody had a lot of traffic. It was a big... There was traffic. Spent 30 minutes, maybe 20, probably 20 minutes in line just to turn in to get to the fair. But I think I already had told y'all that. But anyways, um, I got me a turkey leg, as you saw in the little clip. That was my first time getting a turkey leg from any fair that I've ever been to. And it was hella salty, extremely salty, salty, salty. I would not ever buy another one again. <laughs> Unless it's from my church member who makes theirs. Because they be off the chain. Boom. Not too salty. Just right. Delicious. But anyways, okay. And it's smaller. But anyways. And cheaper because that one was 15 and the ones that um my pastor be selling at church is five so but anyways um my son actually spent 30 dollars on food <laughs> and yeah mm -hmm. it was his money and had nothing to do with it but he was hungry after he left because he didn't he don't i don't know when the last time he went to the fair but spending 30 dollars on food he got two philly cheese steaks uh Chicken nuggets, fries, and a drink. What made me mad, I ain't care nothing about him getting the food. What made me mad was he paid $4 for a drink. I'm still mad about that. Even no, though $10. It was $10. Ooh. Mm. He paid $4 for a drink, which was ridiculous. Because right next to where he went and got all that food from was the guy selling drinks for a dollar. Yeah. Which is where the rest of us went and got our drinks. But yes. anyways, you know, lesson learned. That's him. His money. He ain't got no more money now. So, got nothing to do with me, okay? So, I actually had got only three things to drink, a Philly cheese steak and chicken tenders with fries. The drink was $10. I don't even know why. They scammed me, of course. 
It said $4 know. on the thing. So why did you pay $10 for a drink? And that little old cup. When I tell y'all, it was like probably 10 ounces. It was the little Coca-Cola red and white cup. I don't know if it was 8 ounces, maybe 10 ounces. But I did you really pay $10? I think so because it was 30. Wait, yeah, because he said it was like 13. Wait. And then the other stuff was 13. The chicken tenders and fries was 13. The Philly cheese steak was 13. And the drink was $4. You do the math because that, that ain't my ministry. Um. So anyways... Okay. Yeah, I only got three things for thirty dollars, and I could have had way more. Yeah. But I now know that, so we, yeah, we can move on now. Anyways, as long as they have fun, that's all that matters. I did mm -hmm. end up going to the emergency room because my feet were cramping extremely bad, and they called an the ambulance to come get me and all that. Just rude. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, they have fun. And yeah, I have one thing to say. We warned her about this ride that was super hard. Okay, the ride had nothing to do with why my feet was cramping. I know, but you had to take your inhaler. Okay, I was supposed to take it anyway, so I mean... So at first, it started with the cyclone. She had lost her air, you know. When we went upside down, Mom probably was like, oh, no. I mean, like, I was beside him. She was like... Yeah, of course. You're not... <laughs> like, I had my eyes closed the second time we went on the cyclone me and Dan. Because I, I was like this. Yeah. I got on the cyclone, which is what they're talking about. I was like, oh, I'll just get on this ride with them. Not thinking <laughs> clearly, because that should not have been the ride that I got on. I should have just went on the, the little airplane, the one yeah. that just go up and just spins around in a circle, mm -hmm. and the Ferris wheel. Those are the only two that I should really get on at all, period. This one I should get on there. nothing that spins around, goes upside down, anything, because as soon as I got on the ride and it started, I did cover my eyes the entire ride um, because my anxiety just shot through the roof. And it was going around. Yeah, my it head was, started spinning. It, it was just bad. Yeah, it was going it around. It was really bad. Ride. So I calmed down after that ride, and then I went through the mirrors and down the slide with my nephew, and that's when my feet started acting up. Yeah. But anyways, like I said, that is a story time for another day. It's not for right now, so I can go and get this video <laughs> smushed together, <laughs> not really edited, and upload it. So basically, like I said, this is just the ending of our uh, vlog from Sunday, or the weekend vlog. Today is actually Friday. <laughs> it was supposed to start another vlog today, but we didn't do anything today, but it was at, a, at my parents' house, so whatever. And and then, and she thought my fall festival was today. <laughs> you know, kids are always saying un, you know, irrelevant things that shouldn't be said. But anyways, hey. I know. Like I said, they had fun. Thank y'all for watching this um, weekend family vlog that's actually turned into a whole nother different weekend to end it off. But hey, it's cool. I'm gonna let them go so she can finish watching TV and he can fit to do something. I don't know. <laughs> Thank y'all for watching the yes. video. Um, if you have any comments, questions, leave them, by, leave them down below and I will try to remember to check them and until the next time, bye! Peace! <laughs>